Hello, my name is Jeff Ryan. I'm a CX Solutions Advisor for ASAR America. Today I'll demonstrate SAP Sales Cloud's integration with Microsoft Outlook. SAP Sales Cloud, also known as Cloud for Customer, has an out-of-box integration with Microsoft Outlook. Setting up the integration is easy and can be done in a few steps. Just download the Microsoft Outlook add-in from your Cloud for Customer application and install and follow the instructions. You'll go to your tenant, click on your name, go down to download. Once you click that, you'll be prompted to this window, which is the download section. Under the add-in for Microsoft Outlook, just click download. You'll receive a download execution file, execute it and follow the steps. And then after you're finished, you'll be prompted to your Outlook and you'll have a SAP Sales Cloud plane on the right side of your desktop. SAP Sales Cloud's integration with Microsoft Outlook allows you to work uninterrupted between both applications. This allows for you to connect with customers, schedule meetings, schedule appointments, and manage your accounts right from your Outlook inbox. Customer and sales information automatically synchronize so that both your SAP Sales Cloud and your Outlook application are both kept up to date. As discussed, the plane on the, the sales cloud plane on the right allows you to access your accounts, your real-time news feed, and items that I've placed on my shelf by either selecting them as favorites or flagging them. Items such as favorite accounts or opportunities can be seen in the shelf tab. You see these are two I flagged and these are three that I have favored. As I go through my emails, the contact plane on the right updates to reflect relevant information from the sender by pulling information from the sales cloud. This gives me accessibility to view sales information I need, such as opportunities, leads, activities, campaigns, and quotes. This gives me a dynamic view of the sales information I need right, all right from my Outlook email without having to go back and forth between two applications. These features allow you to do your daily work emailing customers and prospects while giving you a snapshot of important sales information. Real-time synchronization allows for you to not only receive up-to-date information from your sales cloud, but also push information onto it from Outlook. For example, I noticed that John from my ASAR Naperville account has emailed me. I can just drag and drop the email right into my Sales Cloud install opportunity, thus associating this email with that opportunity. So I'll click this, I'll go to Sales Cloud install under my opportunities. I'll get prompted with the synchronization has started. I'll click on this and this will bring me right to my, cloud, my Sales Cloud tenant right to the opportunity, thus saving me the time I need to search through the opportunities I have. I'll go ahead and I'll click on Sales Activities tab. I'll scroll down, I'll notice that I have an email. This is the email, Exploring New Opportunities. I'll click on it. This is, I can see it, the recipient, it was John. This is the one I drag and dropped into our, from Outlook into our SAP Sales Cloud's uh, tenant application. Okay, so back out of this. Appointment and tasks can also be synchronized with accounts, opportunities, or leads. I see that John's interested in seeing a demo. I'll schedule that appointment right here in my Outlook. I'll just go to my calendar. It looks like I have availability on Thursday, so I'll right click. I'll go to new meeting requests. Since my contacts have been automatically synchronized with my Sales Cloud contacts, I can just type John Varan and get the John Varan from my ASAR account. So I'll type John. I can see John Varan from ASAR America. I'll go and click on that. Subject, we'll call this, uh, we'll say final demo. Location, we'll do ASAR America's location in Naperville. Okay, I'll hit save, send, and sync appointment. Now what this does is this allows me to add a reference. In this case, I'll be adding a reference for our ASAR Naperville location. I'll click 
click Add Reference. Okay, I'll then hit Submit. Since my Outlook syncs with my Sales Cloud, my team members working on the Acer Naperville account will see this appointment in our system, thus saving the time I would have spent updating everyone about this appointment. I could directly associate this meeting with a specific account opportunity or lead. I'll associate this meeting with our Acer, Acer Naperville account, and it will now become part of that customer's interaction history. To associate this meeting with an account, I'll simply drag and drop it into my account name. This meeting is automatically synced with the activities for this account in our sales cloud. So I'll go ahead and up here, I'll hit enter. I'll select the account, which is ASR Naperville. I'll take the, the demo day, which is this one right here for our appointment, and I'll drag and I'll drop it in the name. Again, I'll be prompted with the synchronization is started. And now it's become part of ASR at Naperville's account history. Next, I'll go to the feed tab. The feed tab provides me with a view of real-time activities and collaborations that are taking place in my sales cloud between my team members. This feature allows me to continue to work on emails and scheduling meetings while still receiving important updates from my sales network. If I go in here, I'll scroll up here, I can see right here that I've received a message from my manager, Steve Mack. He's asked me how my meeting went with John at ASAR Naperville. So I'll go ahead and I'll write back to him in real time. Okay, and now I'll post it to him. And he'll be automatically alerted to my to my recent post back to him. And this allows us to connect in real time. Once again, saving me the need to go to our sales cloud application. Suppose you receive an email from a new prospect. We can create a new contact right from Outlook. And again, it will sync to our sales cloud. I can see here I've received an email from Mitch Ryan at Calgore. Mitch is a new account for me. And SAP Sales Cloud will recognize that. So I'll unpin our Naperville account, and you can see here it says sender does not exist in SAP Cloud for Customer. I'll add Mitch as a contact. First, I'll click on the plus symbol next to Mitch's name. Now I'll enter known data for him. So if we go back here to the original email, I notice that he has his location right here of where his office is. So I'll go and copy that. And I'll go and paste it in here. I know he works for Calgore. Oh look at that. I know he works for Calgore, so I'll go ahead and I'll put Calgore up here. I'll now hit this map it function. And what map it does it allows me to get it allows me to geolocate my contacts address so I can get a better understanding of their location. This will help when planning future visits. Okay, you see Mitch is located in downtown Chicago. So I'll back out here. This all looks correct. Okay. Okay, looks good. Okay, and now Mitchell has become a member of my accounts. SAP Sales Cloud's integration with Microsoft Outlook allows you to stay productive using the tools you use every day. This add-on gives you the power of selling smarter and faster. Thank you for watching and stay on the lookout for more ASAR America videos.